I would just say me personally looking at the game. Uh, just us not hitting shots and seeing them hit shots. But uh, we, we were supposed to just pick it up on defense, and then that's what we kind of did in the second half, but we were supposed to start out like that. Kevin, you can look at you know, so maybe some of the stuff in the, in the final minute, but was that game lost in the first half? Yeah, it was lost in the first half. And then you don't make free throws. And then guys uncharacteristically taking bad shots that I've not seen us do. And then not rebounding. And the story, you know, you, you got to rebound. We got out, we just, they out rebounded us 42 to 34. That's not characteristic of our teams, but some of it's some of the lineups that I have, I have in there. Um, but we had balls in our hand we couldn't secure. Just we just weren't good. We weren't good in any facet today. Um, I even mentioned in my my game thread that you guys are taking some uncharacteristic shots um, with a bunch of fadeaways and yeah. much more shots. I'm not attacking the paint. How you guys your bread and butter, let's say. You're yeah. paint attack. Um, is there something you said to them that made them change that philosophy? Because when I saw it, I think you guys are one of the best teams when you do have that game plan going right into that paint, right? And then when you start shooting it, then it's kind of like a laid back type of thing. Yeah. So is there just an emphasis of attacking the paint? Always. Well, when you have a little bit of resistance and guys don't want to fight the resistance, which we didn't want to do today, we didn't want to play physical. They played more physical than us. So we settled for shots today. Merv, how do you, you know, you guys have, you know, had up, some ups and, ups and downs. How do you, you know, kind of right the ship here if there's, I don't want to say the ship is taking on water or anything, but like, you know, there's two games left and there's still a lot to play for in terms of seating. Uh, just rally the guys back in, you know what I'm saying? Just try to lock in on that, that one goal just to finish out the season with the championship in AC. So we just got to clean up all the little things, you know what I'm saying? Come back to practice, do everything we did before, just lock back in all together as a group. How much of a reminder uh, of this, even this week, it could be you can beat anybody in the league and you can lose to anybody in the league? You know, it just shows us like everybody in the league is good, so we just can't take any team for granted. So we just got to come out there and play hard every game. Can I thought you did get some good minutes from Corey today. Um, has he been been coming along and and been able to use him in, in certain spots? He's got to get better blocking out down the stretch. He just has to. That, that's his Achilles heel. I thought he gave us good minutes, but that's his Achilles heel. And we fouled too much in the open court. Too much reaching. Um, but yeah, he gave us good minutes. He's he's fighting. He's fighting. Um, is there anything behind putting in Tariq in those last couple of minutes over having Jerry in that spot? Yeah, Jerry couldn't catch the ball today. It's just flat out. He couldn't catch the ball today. And I, it becomes mental. So then I had to get him out of there. How do you uh, balance, you know, focusing on these last two games, finishing out regular season with just, you know, intense focus that the upcoming tournament comes brings? We'll wait till we get there, but we got a, we got St. Peter's on Thursday, so we need to win that game. So we'll focus on that one, and then we got Iona on Saturday, and then next week we'll turn our attention to what we got to get done in the tournament. But we still need to do what we need to do Thursday and Saturday to to go into this tournament, hopefully playing well and doing the things we need to do to win. It's a league where. You know, you can you can change the way you feel about yourself in a matter of a weekend. It is, but when we get in that tournament, it's a single game elimination. So you, you better play with a sense of urgency. If you get down like you got down today, then we're going home and the season's over for us. Um, you guys have been coming back and during that win streak. You guys had a bunch of comeback wins, right? And have, being behind in these late situations, I feel like that's an advantage going into March as well with you guys. But what is the game plan to do to get ahead so you don't have to be in these predicaments where you are behind and that type well, of Well, come out with the same energy you had when you played in that four minute spurt we just played in, right? Come out with that for forty minutes. We've been a very inconsistent team. Do I wanna wait to come back? Absolutely not. I'd like for us to get out to good starts and continue that. You know, I can understand games here or there, but we've had way too many of those. And so, um, that's a mentality, man, that you, you have to just show up to practice and practice that way and let that transition to the games.